Alright guys, Dre Fox here, and I am back! I literally just, you know, stopped recording for a couple minutes and just kept on... Kept on going here because I just literally needed to grab a couple things. But this is going to be a separate video for time reasons. So, let's get right in. God, if I clicked on the screen, that would have been great. There we go. Okay. Son of a gun. Son of a gun. Okay. So, let's try this again. And boom. Boom. Got it. Okay. Let's go. So, the first guy... Oh, ah, room service. Got my CT, yes I do. You pour the CT into the door. Huh? That's just the way I want. Here's a tip. 99 gold. Oh, ah. It's locked from the inside. Oh, ah, room service. Got my cinnamon? Yes. You flatten the cinnamon bun until it's paper thin and you slide it under the door, huh? That's just the way I want. Here's a tip, 99 more gold. You hear shuffling. Seems like you can put something under the door. What? She didn't have anything appealing. So what am I supposed to put under that door? Flash from the inside. Item, mystery key, use. Use the mystery key but nothing happened. So, apparently that's not what I was supposed to do with the key. Looking at you here. It's not what I was supposed to do with the key? Oh! Okay, wrong spot to use the key. What do I slide under that door then? Oh well. Not too worried about it right now. There's two doors. One where somebody's asking for something. Somebody slides something under it. And then there's one where the door is locked from the inside. Excuse me, pardon me. Excuse me, pardon me. Puff the magic dragon. Anyways. So, I got CT from him. Thanks a million. It's locked from the inside. Thanks a trillion. You hear shuffling. Seems like you could put something under the door. Put. But you didn't have anything appealing. I have butterscotch pie, snowman peas, hot cat, instant noodles, spider cider, star feet, cloudy glasses, and dog residue. Or I have stuff in my other... What? Our part face flat? Maybe I'm supposed to get one of the steaks and put it under the door. The Metaton steak? Where it's shaped like his face? Or maybe, let me see uh, what else I have in B. I have a stained apron and more, more, do more dog residue. Let's see if this works. Wasn't it? That face that, that that face steak is like a thousand dollars. Huh? Who are they? Nobody else is supposed to be here. Oh well, we can't worry about that now. <laughs> Fill up my box with hot dogs. Ring. 
Ready? This is it! Take the elevator up to the top of the core. I don't think I'm supposed to be here yet. I think I'm supposed to take this mystery key back to where I'm supposed to use it. Or no, wait. I don't think it's time yet. But I think the game will tell me if I have to go back. The elevator isn't working. What? The elevator should be working. Well then, go to the right and keep heading up. Alright, now just keep heading up. That pit isn't on my map. Forget it, let's try the left side. Fiery pit, yeah. Great alphas. Okay, you should be able to make it through here. Watch out. Magix pops out of its hat. Check. Mercenary only says magic words. Please and thank you. Um, should I stare at it? Chase her up. Weakened by my glare. Whoa! Okay. Stare. The corner arm. Please, thank you. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, incapacitated orbs, and I can spare it. That was close. What? Why are there so many monsters here? I mean, it's no problem, right? We just gotta keep heading forward. Looks like you can't proceed until you hit the switch. But those lasers will have to be when you do. Um, looks like they'll come in this order. Orange, orange, blue. So move it till the third one. Why is she saying that it's that way? She could have gotten me killed. Oh my god, are you okay? I, I'm sorry. I gave you the wrong order. Everything's fine, okay? Let's just keep heading to the right. Thank you for telling me that, babe. A crossroads. Um, uh, tr try heading to the right. Should I follow? Should I listen to her? Wait, no, I think you should head up. Right has lasers. Up has monsters. Night Night blocks the way. Same, yeah. Night Night starts to look sleepy. Adieu. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Fuck, fuck. Night Night watches quietly. Sing. Keep singing. Close its eyes a bit. Close your eyes. Fuck, 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 fuck. Night Night watches quietly. Keep singing. It falls asleep. God. Sorry, I, I... I thought that... Let's try the right path instead. Starting to lose... They have made me lose a little bit of trust here, Alphys. Lasers. More lasers. Okay, I... I won't mess around this time. Oh, I don't mind me. I'm a little tired. I'll just deactivate the lasers and let you through. They're... They're not turning off. I can't turn them off. I... It's okay. I have this under control. 
I'm gonna turn off the power for the whole node. Then you can walk across. Okay, go. I have a seriously bad feeling about this. Alphys! The power, it's turning itself back on. Damn it, this isn't supposed to... I... I'm gonna turn it off again. When it turns off, move a little and stop. Okay? You won't get hurt. Click. Fuck. Oh my god, are you okay? I couldn't keep the power off long enough. No, no, we've got this. It's just a little further. Got it. See, I've got everything under control. Everything's under control. Okay, you should, you should, I don't know. This doesn't look like my map at all. I'm sorry, I, I, I have to go. We're on our own here, folks. Air spells the home, spell of ozone fills you with determination. North is the warrior's path, west is the sage's path. Any path leads to the end. North, south, east, west. Tell me. Oh, map. Where does east go? East, the end. North is warrior, west is sage. East is the end. Get lost and stay that way. To the east, this is the end. I cannot fight, I cannot think. But with patience, I will make my way through. Traverse the northern room and the end will open. Whims a lot. I finally stopped worrying. I've made my choice, Ribbit Ribbit. Terrorize. I'm not afraid of you. A final frog it. Compliment. Tag dropped. Hot dog. Uh, mystify. Spare the frog at least. Okay, act whims a lot. Console? <laughs> Fuck. I got it. I already did. The only thing I have left to do is pray. Wimslot remembers his conscious. There's still hope. You don't have to hit the green with him, apparently. Not with him. Night Night needs to be sang too. Whoa, no, no! Jesus, oh, Jesus, oh, fuck, oh, fuck. Magic? Oh 
Jesus, mercy. Gonna have to go back to Sands for more hot dogs. Think he is. Yes. More than once. Night Night is a girl. You won! That's a lot of gold. Yay, we have a lot of gold. I'm okay with that. What a nightmare. Okay, final frog, it was mystified. I think. No, it's not. It's the final frog. It. That was the final frog. It. I mystify it. Act. Um. Don't pick on. Stigmatism, you gotta be nice to it. That's not what it said. It said finally someone gets it. Yeah, that's why I did. I know what I'm doing. Yeah, I know. I know what I'm doing. Um, I think with you it was Prague. Now what was the point of that? The whole circle thing, what is the point? Do I have to battle something again every time I step? No? Okay, good. Okay, so I did the northern room. Now I gotta go to the western room. Solve this puzzle and the end will open. Okay, so I have two shots. One, two. I'm actually really good at puzzles when I'm not derping. East. Now we go east. Astigmatism act. Stigmatism, don't pick on. Don't pick on astigmatism. Don't pick on me. I didn't. I did the right thing. Behind this door must be the elevator to the king's castle. You're filled with determination. I think I'm supposed to go back downstairs. No, I don't think you fight Asgore yet. Metaton. Oh yes, there you are, darling. It's time to have a little showdown. It's time to finally stop the malfunctioning robot. Not malfunction reprogram and get real. This is all just a big show. An act. Alps has been playing you for a fool the whole time. As she watched you on the screen, she grew attached to your adventure. 
She desperately wanted to be a part of it, so she decided to insert herself into your story. She reactivated puzzles, disabled elevators, and listened to people torment you. Also, she could save you from dangers that didn't exist. Also, you would think she's the great she's the great person that she's not. And now it's time for her finest hour. At this very moment, Alice is waiting outside the room. During a battle, she will interrupt. She'll pretend to deactivate me, saving you one final time. Finally, she'll be the heroine of your adventure. You'll regard her so highly, she'll even be able to convince you not to leave. Or not. You see, I've had enough of this predictable charade. I have no desire to harm humans, far from it, actually. My only desire is to entertain. After all, the audience deserves a good show, don't they? And what's a good show without a plot twist? Hey! What's going on? The, the door just locked itself. Sorry, folks. The old program's been cancelled. But we've got a finale that'll drive you wild. Uh-oh. Real drama, real action, real bloodshed. On our new show, Attack of the Killer Robot. Bitch. Act, Metaton. Seriously, his metal body is invulnerable. Yes, I was the one that rearranged the car. I was the one that hired everyone to kill you. That however was a short-sighted plan. You know it would be a hundred times better. Killing you myself. Metaton. Act. Metaton. Burn. This is probably what you'll do if things continue in this manner. Listen, darling, I've seen you fight. You're weak. If you continue forward, Asgore will take your soul, and with your soul, Asgore will destroy humanity. Oh, thank you, Alphys. Metaton! Burn! That's probably what you'll do if things continue in this manner. But if I get your soul, I could stop Asgore's plan. I can save humanity from destruction. Whoa, shit. Okay. Metaton. Just check him, it's Quirker. Seriously, it's not your body is vulnerable. Then using your soul across through the barrier and become the star I've always dreamed of being. Hundreds, thousands, no millions of humans will watch me. Do it. Do it, his voice makes a yawn. Shit. Metaton. Jesus, his defense is insane. I'm gonna a few people have to die. This show business, baby. I can't see what's going on in there, but don't give up, okay? There's one last way to beat Metaton. It's, um, it's, this is a work in progress, so don't judge, it's too hard. But you know how Metaton always faces forward? That's because there's a switch on his back. So if you can turn him around, press the switch, he'll be, uh, he'll be vulnerable. Well, gotta go. Seems like a good time to turn Metaton around. Turn. Tell Metaton there's a mirror behind him. Oh, a mirror? Right, I look perfect for a grand finale. Hmm, I don't see it. Where is it? Got him. Did you just flip my switch? Yes! I'm hearing uh oh from behind me, but I'm thinking yes. Oh, God. What the fuck? Oh my! What are we, George Takei now? If you flip my switch, that can only mean one thing. You're desperate for the premiere of my new body. Oh god. How rude. Lucky for you, I've been aching to show this off for a long time. So is thanks. I'll give you a handsome reward. I'll make your last living moments. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god! Metaton at EX makes this premiere act. Pose. You pose dramatically, the audience nods. Lights, camera, action! Legs! Why? Legs, why? Metaton! I see that. You turn and scoff at the audience. They're rooting for your destruction this turn. Drama, romance, bloodshed. Oh shit. Justice. Metaton. 
Both, so you say you aren't going to get hit at all. Ratings gradually increase during Metaton's turn. The idol everyone craves. Yeah, that's good to know that I fucked it up already. I'll boast again. I'm gonna end up dying. What do you mean, don't get hit? I boasted and you told me to get hit. Yes, yeah, that's what you just did. That's what you just did. Oh, it's time for a pop quiz. I hope you brought a keyboard. This one's an essay question. Oh, God. What do you love most about Metaton? Everything. Nonsense. Oh, my, what a great answer. Yeah, because I just typed like a fiend. Metaton is saving your essay for future use. Pose. You post dramatically, the audience nods. Your essay really showed everyone your heart. Why don't I show you mine? Metaton. Ah, uh, boast. Say so you aren't gonna get hit at all. Ratings gradually increase during Metaton's turn. So I just don't get hit. What the shit is going on? Fuck! Thanks, Cortani, you fucking bitch! Ugh. So, both of my boasts have gotten screwed up. You aren't going to get hit at all. Ratings gradually increase during Metaton's turn. But how are you on the dance floor? Don't move. They're blue. Don't move. Fuck out of the way of that one. How the hell am I supposed to avoid that? Oh yeah, I needed to hit it. Yeah, I I did I got gotcha. So you aren't gonna get hit at all. Range gradually increased during Metaton turn. Can you keep up the pace? Two, three, four. Okay, I got you, I got you. Item hot dog. There are not enough hot dogs in the world. No! I see that. I see that. Metaton! Pose! The audience nods. Time for a union regulated break. Happy break time. Metaton. Pose. I'll just pose a lot. We've grown so distant, darling. How about another hot to hot? Got his arms. Yes. Act. Pose. He posed dramatically. The audience nods. Arms to these arms with legs like these. I'm still going to win. Whoa, shit. Jesus. Come on. No. How about no? Ah! Act, Metaton, pose! I pose dramatically, the audience nods. The show must go on. Nope! Metaton, pose. The audience nods, drama action!
Metaton. Well, it's dramatically. Nephis, do you really want humanity to perish? Or do you just believe in yourself that much? Actually, I believe in myself that much. Check. Metaton. Despite being hurt, you post dramatically. The audience applauds. How inspiring. Well, darling, it's either me or you, but I think we both already know who's going to win. Witness the true power of humanity star. Uh-huh. Whoa, shit! Dem legs. Legs so hot, hot, le hot leg. Legs so hot, you fry an egg. Whoa, shit. Despite being hurt, you pose dramatically. The audience applauds. Then, are you the star? Can you really protect humanity? Really wanna fuck with me, bitch? No! I gotta live, I gotta live, I gotta live! Stop! Go away, go away, go away! Fuck! I just like you, honestly. You suck so hard, you pain in the ass. Oh, thank God they'll give me an extra health. I was able to break his arms this time last time. Yes. Item, hot dog. You need to eat this last hot dog and then shoot like a mother effer. We've reached the viewer call-in milestone. One lucky viewer will have the chance to talk to me before I leave the underground forever. Let's see who calls in first. Hi, you're on TV. What do you have to say on this, our last show? Oh, a uh, hi, Metaton. I really liked watching your show. My life is pretty boring, but seeing you on the screen brought excitement to my life vicariously. I can't tell, but I guess this is the last episode. I'll miss you, Metaton. Oh, I didn't mean to talk so long. Oh, no, wait, wait, look, they're already hung up. Was that an absolute? I'll take another caller. Metaton, your show made us so happy. Metaton, I don't know what I'll watch without you. Metaton, there's a Metaton shaped hole in my Metaton shaped heart. Uh, I, I see. Everyone, thank you so much. Darling, perhaps it might be better if I stay here for a while. Humans already have stars and idols, but monsters, they only have me. If I left, the underground would lose its spark. I'd leave an aching void that can never be filled, so I think I have to delay my big debut. Besides, you've proven to be very strong, perhaps even strong enough to get past Asgore. I'm sure you'll be able to protect humanity. <laughs> it's all for the best anyway. The truth is, this form's energy consumption is inefficient. In a few moments, I'll run out of battery power and, well, I'll be alright. Knock him dead, darling. And everyone, thank you. You've been a great audience.
Why am I feeling for selfish robot? I I managed to open the lock. Are you two? Oh my god. Metaton. Metaton, are you? Thank God, it's just the batteries. Metaton, if you were gone, I would have. I would have. I mean, hey, it's no no problem, you know. He's just a robot. If he messed it up, I I could always just build another. Why don't you go on ahead? Oh nope, I hit shift. It's out of batteries. I feel bad. Alphys! Yes, dear. So, sorry about that. Let's keep going. She's coming with me? So you're about to meet Asgore, huh? You must be... You must be... Pretty excited about all that, huh? You'll finally... You'll finally get to go home. Wait. I mean, um, I, I was just going to, um, say goodbye, and I can't take this anymore. I, I lied to you. A human soul isn't strong enough to cross the barrier alone. It takes at least a human soul and a monster soul. If you want to go home, you'll have to take his soul. You'll have to kill Asgore. I'm sorry. What do I do? Do I continue? Do I go after Alphys and see why the hell she knew that? Okay, it didn't say anything. I don't think I'm supposed to... I think I'm supposed to go back for Alphys. Okay, so... I'm supposed to go back up, apparently. And... The elevator is in use. So I have to walk. All the way across here. It's so quiet. I don't like it. I don't think I'm supposed to be here. I swear to God, if you don't take that bull back, I'm going to beat you. What? This is just like Toriel's house. New home? Home? This is Toriel's house. A long time ago, a human fell into the ruins. Injured by its fall, the human called out for help. Took the key and put it on your phone's keychain. It's a note. Howdy. Help yourself to anything you want. Flowey when you first actually run into him, which I didn't on this playthrough because of multiple playthroughs. The first thing he says to you is, Howdy, I'm Flowey. Fridge full of unopened containers of snails. This is Toriel's house. Azriel, the king's son, heard the human's call. He brought the human back to the castle. Ways blocked by two padlocks. There's a note attached. Howdy, I'm in the garden. If you have anything you need to get off your chest, 
Please don't hesitate to come. The keys are in the kitchen in the hallway. Two beds? There's a hot shaped lock kit inside the box. Will you take it? Yes. There's a worn dagger inside the box. Will you take it? I don't need a dagger. It's a drawing of a golden flower. What a comfortable bed. If you lay down here, you might not ever get up. It's a twin size bed. A family photograph. Everyone's smiling. There are a lot of striped sweaters in here. I've just been saying I'm a striped stri 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 sweater kind of dude, so. There are golden flowers everywhere. Room under renovations. Over time, Azrael and the human became like siblings. The king and queen treated the human child as their own. The underground was full of hope. Ah, oh, where my yawning? They have a key. You took the key and put it on your phone's keychain. Despite everything, it's still you. As for journal, all the current pages say, all the current page says is nice day today. The ink is still almost wet. A king size bed. A bureau. There's a Santa Claus outfit inside. Macaroni art of a flower for King Dad. Aww. It's a clothes chart. There are rose button up shirts. And a pink hand knit sweater that says Mr. Dad Guy. It's a trophy. Number one nose nuzzle champs, 98. Aww. It's a golden flower. This is just like Toriel's house. You unlock the chain. There's no calendar from the end of 2000 and something. Date is circled on it. I feel like I'm not supposed to be here. Then, one day, the human became very ill. The sick human had only one request, to see the flowers from their village. But there was nothing we could do. The next day, the next day, the human died. Asriel, racked with grief, absorbed the human soul. He transformed into a being with incredible power. This isn't gonna end well. With the human soul, Azrael crossed through the barrier. He carried the human's body into the sunset, back to the village of the humans. Azrael reached the center of the village. There, he found a bed of golden flowers. He carried the human onto it. I feel like I'm missing so much. Suddenly, screams rang out. The villagers saw Azrael holding the human's body. They thought that he had killed the human, had killed the child. I feel like I'm not supposed to be here yet. The humans attacked him with everything they had. He was struck with blow after blow. Azrael had the power to destroy them all. But, Azrael did not fight back. Clutching the human, Azrael smiled and walked away. Wounded, Azrael stumbled home. He entered the castle and collapsed. His dust, bless you, his dust spread across the garden.
The king had fell into despair. The king and queen had lost two children in one night. He who was had once again taken everything from us. The king decided it was time to end our suffering. Every human who falls down here must die. With enough souls, we can shatter the barrier forever. It's not long now. King Asma will give us. Give us hope, save us all. You should be smiling too. Aren't you excited? Aren't you happy? You're gonna be free. Last corridor. I have a feeling I need to go to the elevator. I feel like I'm not supposed to be here yet. Sans? What are you doing here? So, you finally made it. The end of your journey is at hand. In a few moments, you will meet the king. Together, you will determine the future of this world. That's then, now. You will be judged. You will be judged for your every action. You will be a judge for every experience you've gained. What's EXP? It's an acronym. It stands for Execution Points, a way of quantifying the pain you've inflicted on others. When you kill someone, your EXP increases. When you have enough EXP, your love increases. Love, too, is an acronym. It stands for Level of Violence, a way of measuring someone's capacity to hurt. The more you kill, the easier it becomes to distance yourself. The more you distance yourself, the less you will hurt. The more easily you can bring yourself to hurt others. But you, you never gained any love. Of course, that doesn't mean you're completely innocent or naive. Just that you kept a certain tenderness in your heart. No matter the struggles or hardships you faced, you strive to do the right thing. You refuse to hurt anyone. Even when you ran away, you did it with a smile. You never gained love, but you gained love. Does that make sense? Maybe not. Now, you're about to face the greatest challenge of your entire journey. Your actions here will determine the fate of the entire world. If you refuse to fight, Asgore will take your soul and destroy humanity. But if you kill Asgore and go home, the monsters will remain trapped underground. What will you do? Well, if I were you, I would have thrown in the towel by now. You didn't get this far by giving up, did you? That's right. You have something called determination. So as long as you hold on, as long as you do what's in your heart, I believe you can do the right thing. Alright. We're all counting on you, kid. Good luck. I'm too far! There's other shit that I've missed. I should go back. I think I'm supposed to chase down Alphys afterwards. So I'm gonna save here. I'm gonna save here and I'm gonna stop this video right here. Oh my god! So the story unfolds as to why the monsters are down here and what happened and... Okay, so pretty much the king and queen, which we, we don't know who the queen is, technically. She, uh... They, they had a son named Azrael who, uh... When the first human fell down here after they were banished, they took the kid in and raised the kid as if if the kid were their own. And well, some bad shit happened after that. The kid got sick and died. And the kid's one last request was that they be brought to the flowers from their village. So Azrael 
after the kid died in his arms, absorbed the human soul, was able to go through the door, and took the kid up there and died himself. I understand why Asgore's doing what he's doing. He's doing this for his children. He's doing this because he couldn't save his kids. So he wants to be able to do something for the rest of his kingdom since he lost his children. And that's noble as hell. He's not doing it to be a bad guy. That's why everyone says he's such a softy. Oh my god. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it as much as I'm liking this game, let me know down in the comments below. Leave a like, subscribe, share the video so other people can see it. I'll see you guys in the next one. Holy shit! Bye!